So day 26 today. <sighs> this time is just going so fast. But one more day left of work. Tomorrow's my seventh day. So oh, I just cannot wait for it to be over because this week has just been like hell. <laughs> um, okay, so today's vlog, I know some of you guys have suggested some awesome vlog topics, um, but I want to put a little bit more effort into those vlogs and considering it's now eight o'clock and I still haven't had dinner and I still need to pack my lunch. I've washed my hair. <laughs> um, I wanted to do something a little bit quicker today, um, but still, you know, hopefully helpful. So today's video is going to be on how to drink enough water or a few tips to stay hydrated. So I know for some people it can be really difficult to drink water and honestly like water is so, so important. Um, especially if you do get bloated, a lot of it can be from excess water weight. So the only way to get rid of that is actually to drink more water. So roughly I drink about three liters of water a day. Just love you guys, say hello. <laughs> um, so, it has taken me a little bit to kind of work up to that and it was quite hard especially with you know your bladder and at first when you start drinking a lot of water you don't like go to the toilet more often especially if you drink teas and coffees and stuff like that as well throughout your day it's going to make you go to the bathroom a lot more um, so I'm just going to share with you guys kind of what I do what I found has helped me um, so yeah so basically I drink three liters throughout the the whole day so obviously if you grab a bottle of water so just start chugging it down it's going to make you go to the toilet in half an hour's time and then you're going to keep going to the toilet if you know what I mean so the best way I've kind of found to combat the toilet thing like obviously you still go a fair bit um, but it's just to take little sips throughout the day instead of like big glugs so if you actually are finding that you're thirsty you're dehydrated you're already dehydrated you should never really feel thirsty because if you do then you're dehydrated um, as well with the color of your urine it should be like pale yellow white if it's yellow or even orange that is yeah major dehydration so so the aim is you know take small little sips throughout your day that way you're going to get enough water you're going to stay hydrated and it's not going to make you feel like you need to go to the toilet every 10 minutes um, so what I do is I have a big bottle like this and when I first started, what I would do is actually mark the bottle. So like take off this plastic bit and draw a line and say like 10 a.m. So I wanted to drink this much water by 10 a.m. And then have, you know, another line down here like 12 p.m. Like drink enough water by 12 p.m. You know what I mean? So that way it was just a little bit of, of a guide of how to make sure you're drinking enough. Also by having all of your water in the one bottle, that's a really great way to measure. So drinking two of these a day, I know I've drunk three liters. Whereas if I have a glass here, or a glass there, or a sip out of a water bottle, you know, it's hard to kind of track exactly how much water you've drunk. And I find that by doing it this way, it helps me kind of stay on track and I feel a little bit more kind of motivated almost like, oh, I'm almost done, I'm almost at my three liters, you know, keep drinking. So <laughs> um, I find that really, really helps. Also, a few people find, um, like especially if they don't like the taste of water, I don't recommend, you know, adding cordial or anything like that because it can be really packed full of sugar. Even like the diet ones, don't trust anything that's diet, honestly, it's packed full of sugar. <laughs> um, so cutting up some fruit is a fantastic thing to add, like some strawberries or blueberries, anything is going to give you some gorgeous flavor. Even mint leaves are amazing. You can obviously add lemons as well. One thing with lemons though, or, or limes, anything that's quite acidic, is one of my friends is a dental hygienist and she recommends, like because of the acid, like the acidity of the lemons, to, not to drink lemon water all the time because it can actually strip the enamel off your teeth. So she says, if you do drink it, have like a glass of lemon water and then a glass of normal water just to kind of flush it out. But yeah, lemon water is really fantastic to help you detox and all that jazz or even adding a little bit of apple cider vinegar in there. Only a little bit. Trust me, I've added too much before and it tastes like crap. <laughs> so yeah, 
yeah, that's basically what I do. I find just having it in the one bottle really does help. And yeah, if you're struggling to make it taste good, then try adding a few different things to it. Even a tea bag and you can have some cold iced tea. Yeah, it's just a, a good way of trying to track everything. And yeah, honestly, you'll feel so much better. You'll notice your skin will get clearer. You'll lose all that kind of bloating and water weight and stuff. And yeah, you'll be feeling amazing. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. Again, don't forget to check out all of my vlogs I've been doing. I'm surprised I've stuck with it this week. Like, it's been a few times when I've, you know, thought that I wasn't going to get the vlog up. But I've worked pretty hard. So yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying them. <laughs> Alright guys, love you. And I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs>